we learned a real basic blues pattern, and we're going to expound on it real soon and do a 12-bar blues, but right now I just want to get you in to do the basics. So first finger, second foot of the D string, and you're, all, and you're going to hit the A string and the D string together, the fifth and fourth strings. Should be like a crunchy power chord. This is actually a big rock and roll power chord. Like something ACDC would do a lot, okay? Now, third finger, um, two frets higher, also on the D string. So fourth fret of the D string, okay? You're gonna also hit the A and the D string. And now you're gonna go back and forth, hit each one twice, so. So both times the A string, the fifth string is open, and both times you're either on the second or the fourth fret of the D string, and back and forth. So starting on the second, 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 four, four, second, second, four, four, two, two, four, four, two. It's gonna be like. And maybe we'll do some benefit. Okay, we're gonna have fun with that. But right now, just. Just get that. If you want, you can put the palm of your hand, kind of like a little karate chop, right on the, um, like right on top of the bridge, the little white piece there. And it'll give you a little muting sound. It's supposed to, it's more like, more controlled. Whatever you want. Right now, all I care about is that you get, Just get that motion back and forth. There we go. And later we... Right now, just... So first, first, third, third. I'm talking about the fingers. I'm talking about the fingers now. So first finger at the second fret of the D. Third finger at the fourth fret of the D. Of course, you're always doing the open A string. I'm just going to say fingers now. One, one, three, three, one, one, three, three. Or if you want to talk frets, it'd be two, two, four, four, two, two, four, four. Okay. All right, just have fun with that. And if you get it, get brave, try a little pentatonic thing.